Guys, it happened. Colangelo is gone. G O N E, gone, gone, gone. It took long enough, but I guess they had to do their own separate little investigation just to confirm that it was his wife. And I don't care that he said he didn't know about it. It's your wife. Like, how else would she get this information? Is she topping somebody off to get the info? Like, how else would she get it, Brian? Tell her. No, matter of fact, Brian, don't say shit. Pack your bags. Get the fuck out of Philly. Oh, and you can take your daddy with you, too. All right? We, we don't have the time for the bullshit, for the distractions. We're trying to get this check. Okay? We made it to the second round, and we got JoJo and Ben. And, and a couple people here and there. We need to go get some firepower. We can't do that with you causing distractions. So finally, Sixers, Josh Harris, thank you. Thank you for fucking doing your job and listening to the fans. Because I would have had to boycott or some shit. Even though it would have been hard not to watch my team, I wouldn't have been able to watch it if that motherfucker was still the GM. So now, we actually have a shot at getting LeBron, like a legit shot. Like, a legit shot. You feel me? And, um, I'm ready. You feel me? I'm, I'm, I'm ready for LeBron. I'm ready for just to win. I, I want the Sixers to win. I want us to go far. And we have the young guys. If we can get LeBron and maybe another star. Um, and for Fultz and Ben to develop. And JoJo, you got to get that stamina up. A little more in shape. A little more in shape. But um, we can really make some noise this offseason. Brett Brown is the interim GM. Well, I guess. Um, he's head of uh, football operations right now. What I would do is I'm bringing Sam Hinky back or I'm getting another GM. Um, everybody's talking about the Cavaliers GM. Eh, if LeBron don't come here, what the fuck's he doing here? He could be a consultant, but what's the point if Le- LeBron don't actually get here? So, um, I'm glad we got that motherfucker out of here. He and his snake-ass wife undermining shit in, in the front office and the team. And now we can move on with clean slates, kind of like Chip Kelly. Players were disagreeing with him. And then, you know, we get him out, bring back somebody who was already here. And now the Eagles got a chip. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, just saying. So, um... Yeah, about time. Thank you, and um, I'm looking forward to this motherfucking off season. Free agency is July 1st. We got the draft coming up in a couple weeks. I'm ready. We didn't need no more drama. Let's just handle our business and get to going. And um, I just want to say shout out to Carson Wentz. My bae is running at 90 percent, and um, he looks good in those videos. And shout out to the Patriots for falling apart another piece julian edelman suspended four games we broke y'all um you done lost amandola you done lost lewis now you don't have edelman for four games shit gronk might retire eagles the super bowl champs yes it's time to go y'all so now i'm ready for uh the draft that's what i'm looking for in nba and nfl I just want to see Carson practice, and um, apparently a lot of our young guys well. So, that's that break the summer. That's it. And 